Hey everyone, it's a boy Devich. So today's video is actually request trade one from our Discord server. And since it's November and you know what I mean by November, although I thought it's a perfect time to make this video. Now before anyone gets weird, chill. This is purely for the educational purpose, right? We are talking about the jiggle physics today. Yep, that's right. I will show you how to add jiggle physics to any part of your rig bone. And I will try to keep things short, funny and not to curse. So please no questionable comments, okay? Alright, so let's jump right into it before the intro gets more awkward. So first thing first, there you can see I have this character from Sketchweb. And why I'm using this character, why not? our default unreal many queen because this character has some extra bones now what do i mean by extra bones if i will show you here uh, uh let me just hide this lady and yeah now if i will just show you there there you can see we have this two extra bones this are for our breast bones so they will be responsible for our actual jiggle physics or whatever you say so that's why i'm using this mesh but if you want to add the same thing in your many queen what you can do you can import your many queen in blender and you can add some bone by your own then you can do the weight paint but that will take a lot of time that's why i choose this mesh yeah so the next thing that we have to do is to simply import this guy not guy this lady into our unreal engine so now let's go inside of our unreal engine and here if i will show you my content browser there you can see i have this test folder and i know it's a bit messy because i directly just imported it like i didn't separate them on based of textures material and mesh so please ignore that uh, and yeah this is a character which i showed you in the blender and right now if i will just let me just simulate this and if i'll move it you can see there is no physics in it like there is no any jiggle physics now we need to add it here so for that what we can do open our content browser and just locate the mesh and right click on it and here from this create create an animation blueprint and you can name it whatever you want and double click to open it and here the first thing that you will need is a spring controller so from here i will search for spring controller yeah this one and i will simply connect it with our output post and it will automatically add a component to local node and what i will do next i will simply copy it and i will paste it here something like that and in the last i will get my input pose just make sure to connect them all now the next thing that we have to do like we added the spring controller but we need to assign our bones in this spring controller so what we can do simply select the first one and here under the spring bone simply search for your breast bone so for me it's breast and i will select the same but this time it will be for right so i will search for breast right and by selecting both of them what you can do in the stiffness just simply make it something larger i think 420 will be great and for this damping i will make it it and yeah you can obviously play with this all values as per your need and now next thing what this means like uh, translate x y and z that means in which direction you want it to move so we want it to move in uh, up and down which is z and we also want it to move in y axis so i will only disable our x it's completely up to you you can if you want then you can have it in all directions now the next thing we now the next thing here in the scale in out range make it something lower with let's suppose 0.3 and if we will just compile then there you can see after compiling it's uh, jiggling okay yeah so now if i will just play here you will find that nothing is happening you can see uh, the lady is still same why because we need to add this thing inside our post process so for that what you can do uh simply open our this doll skeleton uh not this one sorry open your this doll skeleton mesh and here in the assets detail search for post process and here in this post process animation blueprint you will find it's none so here we are supposed to select so we will select our this doll skeletal nm blueprint and after selecting let me just save it and now if we will just uh, simulate it here then there you can see oh wait nothing is happening let me just uh, okay actually i missed one thing uh by selecting this both i also need to enable it for this not for this my mistake and now if we will just simulate it there you can see we have this jiggle physics so yeah that's enough for this video no comments so make sure to join our discord server hope you liked it love you all bye bye